Hi there. What you're staring at is uh, the latest thing I've been uh, working on, and it's two ferrite yolks wrapped. Uh, I guess it would be opposite to how they're usually wrapped. Um, the idea is to create magnetic fields that go this way and have two of them. Um, the inspiration for this was from videos on YouTube called Prime, The Primer Fields by David LaPont and the, the cool stuff he's done. So now I'm just kind of uh, going, on, going off on a tangent here, trying out some new things to see if I can uh, set up a field like that and just, just experimenting, having fun. Um, right here I'll show you is the idea. We got some specs there. It's 22 AWG. Um, magnet wire and right now what's going on with the circuit I have plus to minus then plus to minus so the wires are oppositely um, rigged up so the magnetism's canceling the only thing different is each wire has its own MOSFET right now running off the same signal so they're timed exactly the same I'm using IRF Z44N MOSFETs. Um, and yeah, I, I, that was the first setup I wanted to do. And it's pretty neat, like, it, the magnetism does absolutely cancel itself out, uh, which I'll show you. I'll show you right now. Um, so right now it's at 14 volts, 0.1 of an amp. I'll um, change the duty cycle up. Let's get here. Give you a shot. There we go. I'll put this duty cycle up, way up, to 60%. So now we're at 14 volts, 2.74 amps. And if I grab this, uh, fair, uh, this ring magnet, put it right in the middle, other than the standard magnetism that's going, that goes on, there is no vibration. Um, so the magnetism is canceling out 100% with this setup, as you would imagine. So I'm going to turn the duty cycle right back down. And as I turn the duty cycle down, I want to show you something on the scope. I have this on one of the drains. So I'm turning it down, down. And I found this effect at it's at about 5.2 it's in the low kilohertz range uh, beneath 10k um, you get the uh, ringing let me show you oops you get the there's a little ring after every on off cycle um, which you can see right there you can kind of see the ripple um, I'll turn up the duty cycle get this dialed in and yeah there's a ring right here but with this low kilohertz range and at certain voltages you get this nice big ring that goes on and I think that has to do with the ferrites wanting to function at these lower frequencies now I'm turning down the voltage so it's kind of weird how you get it then it goes away, then you keep turning up the voltage, you get it again, goes away, get it again. Now we're at 22 volts. You see that? It's pretty neat. Um, now I'm going to turn the duty cycle way down. I'll just keep it here. It's at 7%. And um, this, like I said, this is my first setup. I did a few setups trying to harvest the back EMF off the drains of both uh, MOSFETs. I was able to achieve a COP of about 70, so nothing to write home about there. Uh, one more cool thing I want to show is this is a Tesla pancake coil. I don't know if you can see it. It's not very strong. Um, get there. There is a wireless field. It comes on. This is about six inches away. And I just wanted to show that. It does create a wireless field, but it doesn't work with every pickup coil. These Tesla pancake coils seem to be really good 
pickup coils for wireless fields. And while I have it set up, I just want to throw the scope on the Tesla Pancake coil. So, okay, LEDs on, and I just want to show you. All right, so it is awesome. it's higher frequency going on here with the pancake coil. We got her dialed in. Oh, I wish I had a better scope triggering. Um, turn it up. So there, it's, there's the ring. If I grab it, you can see the ring become more pronounced. So there's, but it's got um for some reason it, it's it's doing its thing at a higher frequency. That's basically what I wanted to show. When I grab the one lead, since I'm grounding it, it, it becomes more pronounced. Um, I just thought that was pretty neat. But uh, yeah, this is my first setup. Uh, the next ones I'm going to not be canceling out the magnetism and we're gonna see what's going on in there. Um, really doing the primer field stuff. Uh, so yeah, this is the first part of the series. Again, I'll um, have more stats for you. There's the unit. Um, all right, guys, thanks a lot. And yeah, more, more stuff to come. Peace.